Uh, look, you know, we've been uh, very careful in the language that we've selected around uh, the uh, the attack, uh, and we will continue to be so. I know everyone wants answers uh, immediately, but you can uh, anticipate the consequences of uh, some um, some inappropriate language. Uh, what we are satisfied to say is that the systems are being re restored. Uh, this the you know operations are happening. Uh, there's some disruption, but uh, patients are getting the care that they need right now. And uh, there was there's still an ongoing RCMP investigation. I'm not going to comment any further at this time. Are we still under attack right now? I mean, again, I have to be very careful about the nuance of what we say, but the system is is, is, is up and running, and uh, we have, uh, th with the whole support of the federal government, uh, been doing our best to ensure that uh, the system is robust, safe, and confident for the providers, specifically with the health care. This is, this is not uh, be very clear, it's not a Newfoundland and Labrador problem. This is a problem that touches all jurisdictions and will touch all jurisdictions at some point in the, in the not too distant future. And as good as your systems can be, uh, there is someone who will uh, potentially be a bit better, as we've seen with the FBI just last week. Planned Parenthood in the United States had 400,000 patients with their data stolen. Like this is, this is a new modern crime, and I think the, the fact that the federal government rallied to support us, uh, you know, that that's, that's the realization for them that this is more than just an individual provincial issue. This, this is a bit of a national issue. And the more we can work together, as we had in this case, to, to, to come together to, for this defense, then I think that, that that's the approach that we should all incorporate moving forward.